All right, guys, uh, let's take a look. Here's an example up top, so if you do get confused, you can always go back up there. All right, so just starting with number one, we want to find the area of the regular polygon. Again, regular just means all the sides are the same, and then all the angles are also the same measure to each other. So our formula is apothem times perimeter divided by 2. The apothem goes from the center straight down to the side, so that is 4.5 or 4.15. The perimeter... Well, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sides that are the same. So seven times the four is 28. So we're gonna do the perimeter is 28 meters. Multiply them together and then divide by two and you get your final answer. All right, don't forget about that perimeter. Um, you gotta go through and, and find that. So it's 58.1 square meters. Okay, so it's just finding that perimeter. How many sides does it have? All right, the perimeter in number two, there is six sides. Six times 10 is 60 centimeters. Okay, so that should be pretty straightforward. All right, then we get down to the end. And the last three are given the area, work backwards and find the missing information. Okay, well, the give us area is 523.32. We don't know the apothem. But we could find the perimeter. This has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sides again. Seven times 12 is 84. So the perimeter is 84 feet. We would do 84 times A over 2. 84 divided by 2 is 42. So 523.32 is equal to 42A. Right, again, I just Simplify that down and then now divide 523.32 by 42 gives you A is equal to 12.46 and then that would be feet. Okay, um, let me know if you got any questions. Have a good day.